Hi, this is Brad Linder with Little Puting, and I'm here with PowerCast showing off a wireless charging system that allows for charging at a distance. So you can see here's the charger, here's the device that's being charged, and it's not touching. So whereas uh, the key wireless charging, or Qi wireless charging, or PowerMat, or some of the others, you have to sort of place something directly on top of the charging surface, so it's not wired, but it's still almost like, uh, you know, you don't have to line up the plug but other than that, it still needs to be touching. Here what we're seeing is the ability to charge things like uh, wireless headphones, keyboards, mice, game controllers from a couple of feet away. It actually works all the way up to 80 feet away, but at that point, you're talking about low, low power devices like uh, sensors for uh, temperature and other uh, home automation type systems. Uh, when you're talking for um, uh, a couple of feet away, you can do the devices like this. Now, it's not exactly ready for charging something like a smartphone or a laptop or higher, higher power devices, this transmitter is only uh, putting out about a watt, and there's a little bit of efficiency uh, loss. So, you know, that one watt, the farther and farther it goes, the more energy is lost. Uh, if you're relatively close to it, it's a uh, fairly uh, uh, low sort of bleed off. But since we're only talking about a one watt charger here, you've probably got night lights that use more uh, power than this. So depending on your electric rates, you're probably looking at leaving this thing running all the time. Uh, it's going to cost you about a dollar a year. So if you've got devices that um, you use on a regular basis and have to charge regularly, a lot of wireless headphones, for instance, might have somewhere between three and 20 hours of battery life. Instead of having to plug them in all the time when you're not using it, just go ahead and place it relatively close to the device. and. Um, overnight it should uh, top off and you can pick it up and just go use it and never really have to think about plugging it in again. Um, this is a company, as I mentioned, PowerCast, that's been working on this technology for a couple of years, uh, actually for more than 10 years. Uh, previously they were mostly doing this technology in the industrial space uh, because uh, the consumer market just wasn't really there yet. Now that uh, you know, smartphones are becoming prevalent and wireless devices for smartphones are becoming fairly common. Uh, there's more of a demand, so you might have lots of little low power devices that need charging uh, in addition to your sort of, you know, keyboard mice, uh, gaming peripherals, also wireless headphones now that we're losing the headphone jacks on uh, smartphones. Um, they're sort of gambling that the time might be right for this. It's not the only company that we're seeing doing wireless charging at a distance. There's a competitor called Energist that is watt up technology, but it's interesting that after a couple of years of seeing them at trade shows, they're, uh, they're getting a little bit of competition here, and both companies are hoping to bring some stuff to market this year. Um, is that, uh, That's right, yes, yeah, so this is our power spot transmitter, like you mentioned. Uh, we just had our FCC approval in December of last year, and the uh, plan is to bring this to market quarter three of this year. Uh, price point for the consumers is $50. And in that time, meantime, while we're manufacturing the device, we're going to be working with OEMs to get our harvesting technology integrated into end devices, which is the real one. So we've shown some retrofit products here to show you the technology in action, show you that it works, show you that you'll never have to plug some of these devices in again. But the real goal is we want to get it integrated, we want to get it into the end products, and that way uh, you'll never have to plug some of these devices in again. So you're talking about headphones, earbuds, keyboards, mice, game controllers, uh, smartwatches, fitness bands, all that stuff that goes around your phone, all that stuff that has its own charger. It's sort of a pain in the butt. You have to plug each one in with the charge. Imagine just putting them all down within a one to three foot range of one of our power spot transmitters and never having to plug those devices in again. So there you go. Coming. Uh the technology is coming later this year uh, for about $50 for the, uh, the transmitter. Uh, the open question is whether there will be a lot of devices that actually work with the transmitter. Yeah, that's TBD, but we yeah. think we're very comfortable with yeah. it. And uh, will people buy the transmitter from you, or will it maybe come with through, the devices? Through distribution uh, or through partners right now. It's a little unclear. Like I said, in the manufacturing process now, but uh, as we have more information, we'll be sure to let everybody know. So, so again, this is Brad Linder with Lilliputing, taking a look at PowerCast, wireless charging at a distance technology at the Consumer Electronics Show in early 2018. Should be available in Q3 2018.